Hi guys, um, I have a mess right now, so please don't look in the background. Um, today I wanted to show y'all how to make your lips look uh, larger than they are. And it is all about contouring, and no, it's not going to look like really bad. So you just want to get whatever color you contour with in a thin brush. And make your lip go like this, you know. We're just going to draw a thin line underneath. Like right now there's a shadow. That's what we want. This shadow that's here, you want it to be there all the time. That's really what contouring is, like just drawing shadows so they're there all the time, not just when the light is hitting it where you want it to hit. So that little line that we see underneath the lip, you want to draw that. Not too dark, but just barely shaded in. Oh shit. That's a bad idea. Blend it out, rub it in, whatever. And if your lips are uneven, like mine are, this one, like, it goes out here more than over here. You want to even it out. Go, make this one go a little bit higher. And this one a little bit lower. And that's how you make that lip look fuller so um you're gonna want to get a lip liner let me go find it you want to get a lip liner of the same color of your lips or a color that looks really natural so we have our lip liner and this one is like a brown tone honestly the best way to find the best lip color that's like natural looking for you this is what i read somewhere and i honestly truly believe it is by matching it to your nipple Yes. Well, your areola. Um, so, maybe this is TMI, but this is a nice little brown tone. Um, so yeah, so you want to fill. See how this is like light, like my skin tone? It's not like a lip tone. You want to fill that in. Okay? But, we're not going to overline too much. We're not going to go like all on this side. You just want your lips to look plumper. So you want them to look rounder. So we're just going to work on this part and on the top part. Just like that. And then my lips are also uneven like here and here. So I'm going to fill this in so it looks more even. My whole face in general is very um, asymmetrical. So over the years I've learned how to, um, you know, fix it with makeup. So here, okay, see how my lip, let me see if it'll focus better. My lip, it also has like right here, it goes up. I don't know what I'm saying, honestly. But right here it's like, it's like pale. You want to fill that in. Just overline a little bit, and the way to make your top lip really look like plumper is to make it look round. I have a very defined cupid's arrow, and I want to undefine it. Cupid's bow, not, yeah, not arrow. I'm so dumb sometimes, guys. I be forgetting. And let me know how it looks. I use my fingers a lot, which is probably unsanitary, but if, you know, that bothers you, do something else. I'm just going to fill this in, my actual lip, because my lips are really pale. I don't know why. And then to complete the look, add a gloss. We have our very expensive Carmex. It was like $2. That's a lot of money. Put it only in the center. Well, it doesn't really matter, but put mostly in the center. And there you have it, guys. Fuller lips. Um, yeah, and it really helps, like, in posing 
and in pictures when you go like this it's like you're you're blowing out yeah like that like and then you just keep them like that see done big juicy lips in like two minutes